So I've been asked a number of times, um, how do we prevent breeding at the sanctuary? And what we've done in the past is a whole bunch of the animals go on a contraceptive implant known as Superlorin. It seems to be uh, very effective in lions and even in hyena. Um, what's been uh, concerning of late is that for the past six to eight months, we have been unable to source um, the, the Superlorin implant. And as a result, uh, some of the animals at the sanctuary are starting to show signs of estrus. Um, and in some cases, like with young Nicholas over here, have actually even bred. So young Nicholas is a result of that. And um, obviously we don't want to uh, perpetuate the breeding here. So we've been doing our homework and we've been consulting with the professionals. And there is a vaccine apparently that hasn't been tried yet. Um, and we have uh, offered for it to be tested here at the sanctuary because we can't just rely on one uh, drug um, that isn't available. Um, so that's the story really of how young Nicholas came about and the predicament that the sanctuary faces when one can't control um, the breeding. So I hope you enjoyed that. If you did, please share it um, and uh, share the message, spread the word, tell people to subscribe to Lion Whisperer TV.